I'm First Alert Storm Team Meteorologist AJ Rickman. We have an area of high pressure that is set up to our southeast. It's been giving us calm weather, but as air rotates clockwise around that area of high pressure, that does mean that we're going to be starting to see some southerly winds, and that's going to bring in some more warm air as we go through our work week. By 9 p.m. tonight, you can see those southerly winds across all of eastern Iowa, and that's going to keep up as we go through the rest of our night into the start of the day Monday and through the day Monday as well. We're not going to see much change in our weather in terms of sunshine. There's going to be plenty of it, sunny to mostly sunny skies for the day tomorrow, and then that turns into a mostly clear night Monday night. Overnight tonight, our lows are going to be a little bit cool again. We'll be in the upper 40s and lower 50s. As I mentioned, we'll have those light winds out of the southwest and clear skies. So it will be a nice night tonight. And then tomorrow, we're going to be a little bit warmer than we were today. Still not terrible, though. We'll be in the lower 80s across the board with those sunny skies. Now, we do have warmer air that is on the way. And that's going to slowly work its way into our area through the course of the week this week. And once it's here, it's going to be here to stay for a while. You can see we'll be having above normal temperatures through the middle of September. We're going to see a little bit of humidity return as well. It certainly won't be anything oppressive or terrible, but we are going to have a noticeable increase in our dew points as we head into the middle and end of the week. We're approaching 60 by the time we get to Friday. And although we're going to have our humidity return a little bit, we're not going to have much in the way of rainfall. Over the next seven days, hardly any rain forecasted for eastern Iowa, so do make sure that you're keeping your lawns and gardens watered. In our nine-day forecast, you can see that dry and warmer trend. By the time we get to Wednesday, we've got our high temperatures at 87, and then that warm air sticks around through the end of the week. We're 87 on Thursday, 85 on Friday, and we stay in the 80s as we go through next weekend and the start of next week.